five, four, three, two, one. Well, good Saturday evening to you, Tennessee Valley. I hope you had a fantastic day. Let's get things started with a three degree guarantee. And that's right, you see the green check, which means another $10 into the jackpot, which is now $150 for the month of February. Of course, David Carnes predicted a high of 55 and we had a high of 55, so it doesn't get any better than that. Be sure to tune in tomorrow at 11. Our predicted high, 63, so a little bit warmer than what we had today. Here's a look at your Skywatcher reports. 59 in Unica, 48 was the high in Athens. Thank you, Sandra, for that report. Sydney and Riceville had 55. Lois and Jasper at 57 degrees. Gwen and Top Lookout, 50. And Saudi Daisy, a nice 57 degrees. Jeremy and Monty Eagle had 55. And, of course, Ben and Somerville calling again with 58 degrees. Overall, pretty typical day for February. Highs were pretty close to average for this time of the year, but I promise you warmer air is certainly on the way as we move into next week. So here's a look at your future cast again as we continue through the overnight hours. Cloud cover builds, not expecting any rain. We're going to have more cloud cover tomorrow than what we had today, but still overall we're going to have plenty of peaks of sunshine, so it's going to be a nice day and these are primarily going to be some higher clouds. Now going into next week, there's going to be a stationary front that kind of drapes right along, right along that Kentucky and Tennessee border. So it's hard to say exactly where it's going to set up, so that's going to make the forecast a little difficult, but it is going to waver a bit. So at times we're going to have some rain rotating through. I think late Monday into Tuesday going to be our first round of some shower activity, not necessarily heavy rain and we're not looking at much of a severe potential, but that is something we're going to track. So as we go into your Tuesday afternoon and Wednesday morning, more showers develop mainly to our north. So I think most of Wednesday dry, but we're going to watch this complex of storms that may roll through Wednesday night into early Thursday morning. That could bring some pretty gusty winds about here across Chattanooga and much of the Tennessee Valley. Again, severe threat low with that, but we are going to watch it pretty closely. Again, kind of the story of the week is just these impulses coming through that's going to bring some showers. So it's not going to be a week long of just constant rain, but there certainly will be some showers out there. I think the heaviest rain likely to be north of the Tennessee state line into places like Knoxville, Nashville, even Chattanooga, and of course portions of Kentucky and Virginia. But the big story next week is going to be the warmth. I mean, we've already been about five degrees above normal for the month of February here in Chattanooga. And as we continue into next week and really through the end of February above normal temperatures look pretty likely. In fact, we have about a 90% chance of above average temperatures continuing through the end of the month here across the southeast. So that heat or February warmth, if you want to call it that, uh, isn't going anywhere. In fact, we're going to continue to see temperatures climbing into the 60s Monday into Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. That's when we could be talking the potential for record high temperatures. I mean, we're going to be about 25 degrees above normal. So Wednesday and Thursday, the daily record for each day was 81, which was was set on consecutive days back in 2018. So if we were to hit 81 degrees on either of these two days, we would tie a record 82. We would break a record not only for the day, but for the month of February. So some pretty significant warmth coming our way. But here's a look at your seven day forecast. Multiple rounds of rain, temperatures climbing to near 80 degrees by Thursday.